Whelan. Effington's made the run. It'll fall here nicely. Kylie, real chance. Oh, he's gone through the arms and in. What a gift for Michael Kiteley. Federici had it and lost it. And Stoke City have the lead. Here's a Fobek, one on one. Is this his moment? Yes, it is. Big goal for Benica Fobek. His first since September. And after those first half misses, that will do him the world of good. Second, just three minutes after the restart for Stoke City to draw level. And it's Benica Fobek who's got the goal. Lovely through ball. He sprang the offside trap and was sure footed with his finish. Shade over 20 minutes left. Either side find a winning goal. So looking the more likely. McLean for Klukas. Bit too much on that for a Fobe. Did well to keep it in. Sent back in. And there's Ince! Oh, what a goal! Tom Ince with a splendid volley. Second in a few days for him. Well, if he enjoyed his goal against his old club in the week, that one will be even more satisfying because it's a terrific finish and Stoke City have turned this game on its head from a goal down they lead by two to one and this was special from Tom Ince Sorensen to take this corner kick bends it in Chester's forward and there's Powell Reading, stunned by Stoke in stoppage time. Nick Powell from close range. Reading had led this game for so long, but they didn't put it away. Stoke have come back at them. Sorensen, good delivery. Chester forward from the back. And Stoke, nick a point. Thanks to Poacher Powell. Scored twice in the thumping win over Hull before lockdown. here. Bobbled around awkwardly, nobody got a decisive touch in terms of getting the ball clear. But it came across to Campbell, it's a tidy finish into the bottom corner. Intercepted by Tommy Smith. Shake of the head from the Reading coach. His side have gone 2 0 down. This is what happens when you press. Brown probably forced to release the ball a little bit sooner than he would have liked. It's a lucky deflection into the path of Fletcher. That's 2 in 2. And a fourth league goal of the season for Stephen Fletcher. Again. Yeah. 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 James McLean gives 
Robertson comes across. Oh, he's left it short. And a chance for a third goal. It's Jacob Brown. Gibson tries to get back. It's a nasty collision with the post. But Jacob Brown will celebrate. He's only been on the field a matter of minutes. And that is that as far as Stoke City are concerned. Scored in the League Cup at Walls. It's his first league goal for Stoke. But again, it's a tale of woeful defending from Reading, given away by the short pass from Lewis Gibson. And Stoke heading for a first win at Reading in 28 years. Their last win.